guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode one of season two of the Quentin Central Quintuplets. Let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. That's still too loud in my ear. Is my thing? No, it is. Excuse me. She gets sick. <laughs> yeah. What's up, Nino? Exactly. Just take it. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was expecting like Ichiga or, or maybe even Itsuki or Miu. Bye, best girl. <laughs> Yosuba. Everyone except eats game.
But yeah, because of a toddle, of course. <laughs> Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Okay, so Itsuki? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Will you shut up? I turned you off. Excuse me. Oh my god. <laughs> Dear Dad. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> 
Mm-hmm. Are you okay? Serious. He's just a kid. Exactly. <laughs> mm hmm. I mean, it's just pictures of her. <laughs> oh. Mm. Mm -hmm. Hell, you could be talking to her right now and you don't even know it. Well, Two best girls, poor babies. <laughs> yeah.
<laughs> oh, okay. My money's on Nino. <laughs> I mean, there are times to tell because there are certain girls who are a little pale paler than others. Oh my god, you have to Oh, who recently took a shower? <laughs> Nino? Exactly. But then what if they're all zeros? Look at you! <laughs> ah, no, yeah, that curse would be. So they all write the same in certain ways. <laughs>
Oh, of course he does. Hell, I think so too. But I've been thought that. She doesn't look like that! <laughs> oh my god. Nico. This was so fucking good. Oh my god. Okay. Number one. Can we talk about the upgrade for this show? I mean, everything looks so pretty. I don't know who did season one and if it is the same people who currently are doing season two. But holy shit, this. It's pretty. Like, really, really pretty to look at. It's like how, um, when I did the working series, um, and I watched season one and how, like, average season one looked and then you look at season two and you're like holy shit like damn y'all got a good ass budget for this even though yes season one of this show is still pretty as fuck too but this is that's gorgeous this is artwork you want to put it in a museum and have everyone look at it and be like look how pretty these girls and Futaru and everyone look because oh my god they're like like look at that that's pretty it's gorgeous! Oh my god! Like, you know I can't. Mean? Yeah. But, okay. So, if I had to take a guess on who Futaro was with five years ago, my money is on Itsuki. If it's not Itsuki, then Nino. Yeah, one of the two. Because they're my best girls. And then... If... Okay. I, I, mm, god. So, yeah. Those two. And then I think my third would probably be everybody's best girl Miku uh, because I mean because like him and Miku ha I mean he has chemistry with everybody uh, I mean because like I felt like it, it, it has to be one of those three I don't know if y Yotsuba would <laughs> Yotsuba would kind of do something like that Ichiga as well I mean it, it's one of them that's the thing I don't know I mean but my money is on the top three those three I can see because when you're looking at Ichi, uh, not Ichika, um, Itsuki, Miku, and Nino, like, just the attraction that's there. Like, not to say that he doesn't have any attraction towards or chemistry with uh, Yotsuba and Ichika because it was there also in season one. But when we're looking at season two and me still wondering how this manga ended and shit because your girl didn't read it your girl doesn't want to know jack shit about it or anything it's just those three girls are like the top three that i can say who have the most chemistry with him especially like freaking miku because uh, like, don't not remember everything that happened in season one but then at the same time you know itsuki and how she's my best girl same thing with nino especially freaking nino because she is literally me like i, I swear to god i'm like a mixture of nino and Nino Ichika and Itsuki with a little bit of Yeltsima because I'm very, very goofy, but I can be serious at a time. <laughs> I just remember how, like, she she saw, like, the disguise that Futaru was wearing and, you know, was like, yes, you're the type of guy I would go for. And I was like, oh, I was like, so then maybe that was you as a kid. I don't know because that's the feeling that I've been having ever since you know because it's been like two years two three years since season one came out and how god I don't know I mean it could be anyone it's just I would like to know but please don't spoil me I don't want to know jack shit about anything 
going into the rest of this season but yeah this was a really good first episode like i said everything's fucking gorgeous as hell beautiful put it in a damn museum mm -hmm. museum of anime mm -hmm. i psh, i go there every freaking day <laughs> But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode one of season two of the quintessential quintuplets. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the National Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Thursday for episode two. Bye, guys.